Beaver game, the newest professional athletes in Indianapolis are set to show off the skills of their sport. The Indy Ignite are part of the Fever's pregame party. Let's turn now to News 8's Colin Bailey. He's at Gamebridge Fieldhouse. Colin, I know you're having fun. You've been talking about how you've been having a ball out there. Tell us what's going on this morning. <laughs> Yeah, we're having a ball out here. It's really cool because this may be the community's first time really interacting with the Ignite, the players, the staff. It's going to be really fun. You can come check this out. These volleyballs got some gray leather on there, but we had some fun before. It kicks off at 5. Randy, thanks for joining us. I know we have this sign behind us, but what are we doing here today, later, before the Fever game? Yeah, so we're going to be activating out here on Bicentennial Unity Plaza. Uh, the Indy Ignite players that we've signed, a few of them are going to be here. They're going to be demonstrating their skills. We've got some fan engagement stuff. We've got some winners that are actually going to get to compete on the sport court with our players. And the Indiana Fever have been amazing partners in this. They're going to have a lot of fun stuff for the kids as well. And we're going to have some really sweet giveaways, Colin. Yeah. And the first 200 folks that get here are going to get this really awesome shirt. And look, we're, this is not a moment, it's a movement. And we're just right here with you guys, making it a movement and continuing to push it forward. So we're excited to be here. And your shirt says, everyone watches women's sports. How do you all try and hope, you know, continue that movement right now? Because a lot of people are tuning into the WNBA. Obviously, you guys are the eighth franchise in the professional volleyball federation. How cool is that? But how do you continue to grow women's sports? Yeah, I think it's getting in the community, like making sure that all those volleyball players throughout the state of Indiana, we already know volleyball is huge here in the state. And just getting out there, showing them that you can be a pro right here in central Indiana. We're going to be playing up at Fisher's Event Center, which is going to be completed here in the next couple months. We're super excited. Couldn't have a better area uh, to be starting this professional women's volleyball team. So I know we have this sign behind us. Tickets just went on sale on Monday. How have they done so far with season tickets? We've been doing great. We've got an awesome ticketing team and people, our, our phones are ringing for the people that made their deposits. They want to get their tickets solidified. Um, so that's going really well. Yeah, we're, we're having a ball doing it. It's going to be a great time speaking of this. Yeah. You can come out 5 o'clock tonight, kicks off. Come test, test these volleyballs out, test your skills out. Come meet some of the Ignite members as well. Again, it kicks off at 5 o'clock. But for now, outside of Gamebridge Fieldhouse, I'm Colin Bailey for Wish TV, wishtv.com, or follow us on Facebook for updates.